Hi guys, how are you? Today I am going to be doing an update on my current Wreck This journal. If you have been watching my videos for a while, you know that this journal is all Peter Pan themed. So every single page in this book has to somehow be inspired by a version of Peter Pan. This page told you to crack the spine. And since I have had this journal for so long, I cracked the spine a long time ago, but I just never knew how to decorate it. What I finally decided to do was to draw Wendy having to walk the plank. So here is what I drew, and on the bottom is some washi tape that looks like ocean waves. The page next to that said to leave this page blank on purpose. I had a little Tsum Tsum Captain Hook sticker, so I stuck that on the page and had him say no, because I don't like to leave blank pages, even if the page tells me to. Here is the little sticker, and I got that at Hot Topic. This page told you to stand here, wipe your feet, and jump up and down. I really don't like doing things that involve feet, because I just don't like feet. Um, so I thought I would write, why stand when you could fly? And I drew Peter Pan flying on the page next to it. Here is what I did. I drew Peter Pan on sketch paper and colored him in with alcohol-based markers. And on the page with the prompt, I added some washi tape to add some color. The next page I did told you to poke holes in the page using a pencil. After I did that, I decided to decorate the page with the TikTok croc. I figured he is a pretty destructive character, so he kind of went with the page, in my opinion. So on the page with the prompt, I did poke the holes in the page and I wrote TikTok. And at the bottom I added some washi tape. And then on the page next to it, I drew TikTok croc and I added some more washi tape. This page told you to document your dinner. And one of my favorite Peter Pan movies is called Hook. And if you have ever seen that movie, you will know that there is a dinner scene with the Lost Boys and Peter, and they are eating imaginary pie, and it's really colorful, and it's a really fun scene. So I decided to, on this page, draw the imaginary pie, and on the page next to it, I drew a spoon with a scoop of the food and a quote from the movie. Here is the imaginary pie, and there is the spoon. This page told you to scribble wildly and violently using only borrowed pens and to document where they were from. I did this page while working in journals at my best friend's house and um, I didn't want to just scribble on the page so I drew the darling children with Jolie's pen and then using her colored pencils I kind of scribble colored them in. So here is what I ended up doing to the page. This page said to cut through several layers. So if you look down at the bottom, I did cut through several layers of paper. And then on the blank page next to it, I drew Captain Hook as if he is the one who cut through several layers with his hook. So here is Captain Hook. This page had a circle in the middle of the page and it told you to color outside of the lines. So I decided to use the circle as if it was Mr. Smee's head, and I drew his body around it. And on the blank page next to it, just to add some color, I used washi tape to match his clothes, and I did stripes. This page had the black circles on it, and it told you to connect the dots with your eyes closed. I did that. I don't know if you can see the pen going from circle to circle, but I did do that. And then I decided to make it look like the circles were the middle of flowers. And I had some Tinkerbell fairy stickers, so I put those on as if they were sitting and flying around the flowers. I have shown this page in videos before, but now it is finally finished. This is the page that tells you to hang it in public and invite people to write or draw. And I've just been adding little drawings of Peter Pan that my friends have made for me. When I was visiting my friend Jolie, she drew Tinkerbell drinking Starbucks, and that filled up the rest of the page, so it is now finished. 
this page told you to doodle over top of the page and if you actually have a breakfast journal before you doodle on the page you should read the page it's kind of funny um, but I decided to just draw Peter Pan sitting on a cloud here is what I did and the last page I have done since the last video if you can see there is some Tinkerbell washi tape on this page the page behind it told you to figure out a way to attach the two pages, so I used the washi tape and I taped the pages together. That is everything I have done in my Wreck This Journal since the last time I posted a video on it. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Thanks for watching, I love your beautiful faces, and I will see you next time. Bye!